spraying up a storm in Venus. 27-year-old Leanne. Yeah, the death of me. She's made full use of her overhead luggage allowance. I've been to Amsterdam twice, and both times customs have searched my bun for drugs on the way out of the airport. They didn't find any, obviously. <laughs> I have to make that a bit clear. <laughs> okay. I think serial dating has had its time in my life now, so I'm ready just to date the one person. How are you? I am shitting myself. I tend to go for black or mixed race, man. Uh -huh. Facial hair, family orientated is really important. So I absolutely adore my family. Anything on those lines and we're on it. Right, Merlin's gonna look after you. Oh my gosh, thank you. Enjoy, see you in a bit. Oh, thank you, Fred. Hello. Hello. You've had a time to sort of find your bearings. I have, and yes, yeah. And do your hair, looking do nice. Do my hair, yeah. My trademark is my hair, I tell you. I'm very good at putting on like a facade in a way. When I've got my makeup on, I feel like I'm a different person. My makeup hides a lot of my insecurities. Hide behind my eyebrows. <laughs> how are you? I'm good, thanks. How are you? Good evening, very good, thank you. You look like super cool. Uh, it's not a facade, it's a facade. Is it? It's deep inside, I'm like this. Oh, oh you'll be all right then. Karen, thank you. There you are. Hello. Hi, nice to meet you. You too. How are you? What's your name? See ya. Nice to meet you, I'm Leanne. Pleasure. Are you as scared as I am? Yes. OK, good. <laughs> In doubt, I'm like, ugh. <laughs> Hello. What can I get you to drink? Um, a double whiskey, please. Double whiskey. What's <gasps> going in? Uh, double <laughs> Where are you from? So I was born in Zambia. Oh, wow, OK. And I moved to the UK in 2004. Just finished at Northumbria Uni now. What do you do at Northumbria? Uh, law. I've just finished my second master's. Lawyer? Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no. I am a lawyer. Oh. Yeah. It's happened a lot when I've been in, like, a courtroom. My opposition's obviously seen me. I think a lot of the time they kind of underestimate me a bit, but when the lawyer side comes out of me, I think they're a bit taken aback by it. <laughs> High five to that. Well done, we've yeah. Done, we've done well, well done, we've done well. Yeah, we've done well. <laughs> Finding it really hard to eat this, though. Put a little bit on your fork, yeah, yeah and then spin it. Yeah, but it's all... Side on, side on. Keep it there, keep it there, keep it there. Stop. Oh, you ruined it. <laughs> So how many relationships have you had? Um, was that a sensitive No, it topic? wasn't. No, no, no. I don't regret any of it. Yeah? One yeah. was just, like, perfect, like, physically. Like, this is it for, yeah. like, for life? But when I ended it with him, he got a bit nasty. He sent me quite a rancid message that was along the lines of, the next man that you're with will have to be blind to see you with no makeup on. I shouldn't have taken it to heart. I obviously have. And since then, I'll never feel 100%, I don't think, with, with taking my full makeup off anyway in front of a guy. If you see me with my eyebrows off, by the way, like, I'm going to marry you, just to let you know. Because <laughs> they don't come off ever, like, for anyone. And that's why I was single for so long, because men are trash. No offense. Uh, boys are trash. Yeah. <laughs> men are not. <laughs> <laughs> I am, like, actually overwhelmed by how well it went, like, how much we had in common. It was ridiculous. <laughs> uh, check, please. Yeah, let's, let's <laughs>